Hello and welcome back to my channel Learn with Nikhil. So in this video we are going to see to design a nameplate on a 3D printer using Tinkercad. So first on Tinkercad we'll select the text which we want to create a number plate of. So here I am considering the text. I'll make it height as 1 millimeter. All the dimensions here are in millimeters. So I'll replace the text with the name which I want to create the number plate of. So this is just a random name which we are considering. By holding the shift key as you can see I have reduced it proportionally. So hold shift and then drag the corners you will reduce all the dimensions proportionally. Now this is the name which we have to print. This is the base of the name name plate. So I am considering it at a height of 2 millimeters. We can increase the dimensions also later inside our slicer software also before 3D printing. So this will be the base of the name plate. I will place this above this plate. So I will increase the height of this name at a height of 2 millimeters. So hold this triangle, drag it upward at a height of 2 millimeters. Now we have placed it over this name plate. Also, we have to write the designation. I'll increase this height of 40 millimeters, this depth of 40 millimeters. I'll place the designation in front of this name. So, just a designation. Now, again, shift and drag this. So, this will reduce it proportionally. Height of 1 millimeter again for this. holding the triangle and moving it upward at a height of 2 millimeter, selecting and placing it on this. So as the base plate was 2 millimeter height, so we move both these names at a height of 2 millimeter, reduced it proportionally and arranged it. Now as this is a big name plate which will not fit in one piece inside our 3D printer, so what we'll do, we'll break this down. We can use different softwares also to break this down like mesh mixer where we can separate the two uh, plates and you can design it. But for now I am doing it here only. I have created two different plates with two different names. One for Shri Rajesh the name plate and one for Gyani and Secretary. I will separate this also. So separating will help the you can design it in one go on the 3D printing but not at a length as the 3D printer length is of 200 millimeters width base and height is 400 and our name plate is bigger enough which will not fit in one. So we are separating the names and we'll make it in this two halves. Now the main task to make it 3D the sweeping text. So first step we will change this grid to 0.25 millimeters. Next select the text. I will select both this text. Press Ctrl and D. D means duplicate. So we are duplicating the name. Press Ctrl and D two times. Press Ctrl then D two times press it. So it will duplicate two times. Then while holding the control, press the back arrow two times. So this text will go backward two times. Then change the degree. You can change it to three, four degrees. Then press control D continuously and it will duplicate according to the angle which you have given that is three degrees. Simple procedure but don't change or press anything while doing these steps. Here also you can see first control D, control D two times, then press back key while holding the control two times, then change the angle to three degrees, then control D continuously, press D, D, D while holding the control button which will make this a gradient look 
of the name plate which gives a good 3D effect. Now we have designed the name plate simple as it is. Now we will download this files select export into HTL file. There will be two files as it is the Tinkercad server is quite slow so it will take some time to do it. If it does not happen you might get some errors. So you can reduce the dimensions and you have to try it multiple times as the server is quite slow it gets hanged sometimes after downloading I am opening this into my Creality software the slicer software exporting the files over here. So that is it I am making this the y dimension y axis of 65 millimeters. So depth is 65 millimeters I am keeping it common for the entire name plate. So the name plate will be proportionally. So I am printing it Sri Rajesh over here arranging it in front side and my other is still downloading. So it has been downloaded opening it here only again the y axis I am keeping it 65 millimeter. This is the uniform scaling placing it back side this is uniform scale just checking it once whether everything is fine you can slice it see the time before slicing also you can check all the settings which we have done it perfectly I will just show you the infill is around 15 percent here I have kept the Z hop I have enabled the Z hop so retraction and Z hop is enabled Z hop is a good method of the nozzle jumps while going from one place to another you can keep this all at once only uh, one at a time might be risky sometimes the build plate addition I have kept it none you can choose accordingly this is the big name plate so I am not keeping it none basically the addition type the skirt or brim is usually if the attachment of the plate to the build is quite low or minimum here it is not required. So this is the skirt which we have used but I am using it none then do the slicing after slicing before saving it kindly check whether all the parts are sliced properly sometimes there is a missing in one layer which will cause the entire thing to rupture or the it will be destroyed a mess will be created so just check once whether every layer is properly there give it a good check and then save to the file transfer it to our 3D printer and it is ready to print. So here we are using a Creality Ender S1 Pro they are just the examples which we I have printed which took around 18 hours to print the big name plate see how layer by layer addition it is happening a slower process but a very effective one the quality is quite good after around 18 hours of this print you have to do the post processing also this name plate creates get some colors to it you can apply some colors do the post processing sanding and everything. So this one of the name plate was created. So for the post processing we are doing some coloring sanding has been done. You can paint as you like acrylic colors are used. The white material is good enough the colors are very nicely getting into it gives a good look. So finally the name plates are ready to dispatch. They are looking pretty good. For the base we have made an another separate thing which gives the support. 
you have to just stick it to that and they are fine thank you for watching do subscribe to my channel if you have any doubts let me know in the comment section